Are there signs of recovery in March? Is the process of decline in the stock market going to stop? Is it time to build a portfolio? All these questions or expectations are being created because those who keep an eye on the data of the stock market are eyeing such a figure from which they are expecting a bounce back. Before looking at that figure, let us understand what was the reason for the fall in the market for the third consecutive month. So first, let's look at why did the stock market actually fall. The stock market sentiment was already down since the start of the Russia-Ukraine war. Due to the increasing inflation across the world, the process of increasing the interest rates, which once started, is still going on. After the softening of crude oil prices, it seemed that the stock market sentiment would improve in February. But then came the Hindenburg report on Adani Group on January 27, due to which not only Adani Group's shares, but also the shares of many sectors including bank, insurance crashed. The market sentiment was so bad that in February alone, there was a decline in eight consecutive trading sessions which happened for the first time in four years. Now let us understand what kind of figures have come out due to which recovery is expected in the month of March. Now why is there a recovery in March? If we look at the figures of the last 10 years, whenever there is a decline in the stock market for three consecutive months, there is a sharp recovery in the stock market in the subsequent month. Since 2011, there have been nine times when the stock market has given negative returns for three consecutive months and every time there has been a good recovery in the fourth month. This time, there has been a decline of 8.3% in Nifty between December and February. If we talk about March alone, since 2012, there have been seven such occasions when the stock market has seen a boom, while there have been four occasions when the market has been in the red mark. So then, Will history repeat this time as well? On this, Ravi Singh, Vice President of Share India says and I quote that it is a natural rule of the market that after a big fall, investors buy heavily at lower levels and book profits at upper levels. The historical figures of the stock market also prove this. However, whether the ongoing selling pressure in the market will continue or not will depend on the sentiment and fundamentals of the market.